Well, boys, look what we have here. Look like the ocean gave us a jewel. Bring her aboard, Mr. Granger. I want to see this mermaid up close. Hold the net steady, men. I don't want her to escape overboard. Stay away from her. You know the rules. The captain gets to inspect all treasures first. And if any of you want to complain about it, you're welcome to challenge me for a position of captain. But be warned, lads. I don't tolerate mutineers on my ship. You're either with me, or you're against me. What say you, men? Good. Then break out the rum. We're rich, boys. As for you, mermaid, you're coming with me. You're bleeding, lass. Hold still. Relax. I'm not going to hurt you. I just don't want you bleeding on my sheets. This is going to sting. Lass, that cut is too deep not to clean. I don't know how things work in the sea, but if you're leaving a wound like that untreated, you'll end up dead by morning. Hold still. Easy, lass. Do you speak? Yes, lass, I can understand you, accent aside. You've come pretty far from home, haven't you? You're not the first mermaid I've met. No, lass. When you've been on the sea as long as me, you see more things than most other sailors. I've sailed to remote corners of the sea, hunting for treasures you can't even imagine. I can't do that. I'm a pirate, lass. You'll fetch a fair price. Afraid that's the way the world works. Rest assured, you'll be under my protection for as long as you're on this ship. I give you my word as captain. <laughs> I suppose so, but you've got no choice but to trust me, lass. That or you can go sit in the brig, your choice. Enter. Mr. Granger, I trust the crew is enjoying the rum. Good. Now fetch me a bathing tub. Fill it with sea water and bring it here. I'm not a monster, lass. I know you'll die without water. Like I said, you're not the first of merfolk I've met. That was another life, lass. One that doesn't concern you. That will be all, Mr. Granger. Come here, lass. Of course you have a choice. You can stay there until you dehydrate and die if you wish. 
your corpse will still fetch a fair price. Or you can be sensible and let me put you in the water. Good choice, lass. You'll stay here until we reach port. Then you'll be sold. Glare all you want. I'm a pirate, lass. Like I said, this is the way the world works. <laughs> I don't know what that means in your tongue, but I know a curse when I hear it. That's all right, lass. You won't be the first to curse my name, nor will you be the last. You can address me as Captain Flynn. And you may as well get comfy, lass. You'll be with us for the next few weeks. Yes, you'll be staying with me. Unless, again, you prefer the brig. That's what I thought. I gave you my word that you'd be safe with me, lass. Long as I'm here, you'll be treated well on my ship. Welcome aboard, lass.